Hi vlog, I'm Emma. I am the shopper for Lake Clark Resort and I was asked to take you along um, for some of my journeys. So here I am, Costco Business Center. We're gonna go hit it. I um, leave my coffee in the car. It's like a little reward when I do my trips. So I'm basically a local here now. Everyone knows me and says hi to me. So, yeah. Okay, I am on the search for applesauce and jam. I found jam, but it's not the kind we wanted. So I think I have to go to the other Costco for that. But also, who made Costco system? Because who was like, let's just put everything in aisles and not label any of the aisles and let people search for it. Because now I can't find applesauce. I have to go to the other Costco too, but here's the haul so far. Sorry, I'm not a professional vlogger like Selena, but also I think I need a GoPro strapped to me because I realize that I talk while I shop and like people give me weird looks. I right, vlog out. Applesauce acquired. Whose genius idea was it to put applesauce right next to green beans? Never would have thought. Also, um, just had Costco boys say hello to me because I haven't been here since last week. So, yeah, living the good life, I guess. Okay, so I have all of the like non perishable stuff. It's gonna be hot today, so I'm just gonna take this stuff as the load. I'm gonna take it out to the car um, and I'll come back for fresh stuff and groceries like that. This is a smaller load, but I can't vlog in public. This is embarrassing. I already get enough looks as it is being a like 19 year old girl pushing a cart full of stuff that I will never eat. So vlogging makes it 10 times worse, but yeah, I'll update you guys. Okie doke. First load is all look. And now it's time for that extrinsic motivation that I need. Also, can I just say Costco Business Center, like employees, restore my hope in humanity. Because every time I go, they're always so happy and say hi. So be kind. Buy coffee. Now it's time for round two. Okay, um, I just did the second load. I forgot to video any of it. So yeah, but this what we got going for us. Now to watch me struggle while I load this and sweat because it's hot out. Okay, she's all loaded up. Hall. Now I just need to tag everything. So. Okay, so I enlisted my mom to come and help make labels because I ran out and the guys in there don't want to help us poor women. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But yeah, thanks mom. Oh, and George. It's his birthday today. Happy birthday, George. George, look at the camera. All right, he hates you. Um, How many more? How many more? Labels. How many more labels? <laughs> I'm done. 
vlog, we're trying to simply five, but um, some of this gets sent to like Leela's uh, Costco stash, Costco stash, her storage in the house, and some of it gets sent to the cash, and the rest of it goes to the resort. So it has to be labeled differently. And I've been doing it at the office, but it gets really confusing. I should really want to just get it out of their face. So I tried my Aunt Sis's method. And we're just gonna label it in store before I check out. And we'll see how that goes. Also, I can't find everything in this Costco, so I could go across town to the other Costco to get it. Okay, so I labeled different things like this is LCR, cash, and Lula. So now they'll get put into their different areas properly. I'm gonna see these guys But Overall, it's for the win. Okay, so I just went to the other Costco, didn't video it, but now I'm at Fred Meyer's um, getting some lemons, parsley, not lemons, melons, parsley, and something else in the list. I'm blinking, but last saw. Okay, so vlog update. They didn't have red cabbage, so now I have to go to another store. I'm not sure which one yet, but got the melons and parsley, so yep. Bye, Fred Meyer. My cousin Emma has been doing a fantastic job filling in our, long story short, the person who does the shopping for us, she got injured literally in the beginning of the season and was not able to do like heavy lifting. Um, I think she threw out her back or something like that. But my cousin has been helping us out and doing shopping for us, which has been a huge blessing. Had a little bit of freight come in. So I'm heading down to Lake Lark Air and we're gonna go check it out. And also on my way there, talk to you a little bit about that whole process because when we get freight and it gets taken to the air taxi like you saw in the video, it's not always gonna get here at the same time. We had a bunch of stuff get here like around dinner time last night. It's like almost 10 o'clock now and we had a little bit come in so there's not gonna be a whole lot in this load but you're gonna see some and we take it over to the resort and sort it put it where it needs to go. So this is the plane that the freight came in. Oh, and here's my coworker now coming up. But we're gonna go see what's all here. Stuff came in on this plane along with our clients. Hello. Did we get a lot of stuff? Oh, nice. So a little bit, but fun. <laughs> You come to steal our eggs. So that was super easy. This is it. A lot of stuff came in yesterday, so I'm assuming this is the last of it. We have a checklist that we'll go through when we get to the lodge to see if we're missing anything. So let's go put it away. that it came in but we're still missing a bunch of stuff so I bet there's more stuff coming in the next like I don't know today so we're gonna start marking things off Have different fridges and freezers for different things like a meat freezer we have a breakfast freezer this is literally all bread veggies berries and then we literally have a fridge that is full of dairy 
and eggs. And then another fridge that is full of just veggies. So as you saw, like I had to take out all the eggs and put in um, the new eggs on the bottom so that way it's done first in first out type of a style because we don't want things to be going bad, especially being out here where there is no store. Um, everything has to be flown in, everything is extra expensive. So to be the most efficient, and you're supposed to do that in like the kitchen restaurant style anyways, um, being the most efficient with what we have, first in, first out. And because we have not finished the list, there are still things coming in. I'm gonna put this back in the kitchen, so. I was like, where's that plane? I'm gonna put this back in the kitchen so that the next person who gets freight can mark it off. And we make sure that we get everything that was ordered. Thanks for coming along. See you guys next time.